Kia ora koutou. just want to take you through uh, the journal assessment and how to go about doing it. So I'm on our mLearning page and the assessments. So I'll just scroll, scroll down and show you where it is. So assessment one is the reflective journal. And there are, or there is a description of, of what's required. Ten entries reflecting on mLearning and a thousand words in total. So that's pretty much a hundred words each. We've got a suggested format there for putting your journal entries together. And then underneath that, there are three steps that you need to go through to create your journal and get it submitted. So let's go through those. So step one, just click on this link. Now what we need to do is create our M Learning Journal. Let's do that. So content and journals. And then we want to create a new journal. So click on create journal. And I'm going to call it M Learning. And we can describe it. And I'm going to put M Learning in the tag there as well. And click Create Journal. And you'll notice that there is a folder there for it. And it currently has zero entries. So to make my first journal entry, I'm going to click New Entry. And uh, this is where I'll put in uh, my first journal entry into the body. And I should tag all of my journal entries with M Learning. Just makes it easier to find later on. Now, if I had a file that I wanted to attach to this journal entry, I could do that using that button, uh, much like you would with attaching a file to an email and click Save Entry. Okay, now we're going to go back to Moodle and Step 2. So what we need to do now is copy the template that I've set up for you to put your journal entries onto. So click on the link and you'll see that um, we have uh, a template for which you can add your journal entries to. So the first thing you need to do is click copy this page. And you only need to do this once, okay? Otherwise you'd be making multiple copies of the same template. So click copy. And you can put your name into this if you want. Um, but basically it's ready to go. So we can go to, uh, you can click save, now it's ready to edit. And what I'm wanting you to do is add your journal um, to this page. So on the left hand men menu you'll see journals. I'm just going to drag and drop the first option onto my page. And I'm going to select M Learning from the list. And I might just change entries to 10 and click Save. Now my, my first entry is added to my page. And whenever I want to um, add more entries, I can just click on this button to do so. So I don't have to go back to the content area to do that. Right, last step. The last step is to share it with the tutor or submit it for marking. Now, I would like you to submit by week four at the latest, please, um, so that uh, as the tutor I can just go on and have a look at your journal entries over the semester. Please don't leave your journal for the end of the semester. Okay, you're not going to get any feedback from uh, by doing it that way. Right, so to submit, um, I'm just going to become a student, so we get to see the same thing. 
So step three, click on this link. Add submission. Then you need to choose your mLearning page from the list shown. Now I'll have a lot more pages than you will. Um, so I'll just scroll down and find my mLearning Reflective Journal 1. And then I can click Save Changes at the bottom. And that will then put it into um, the gradebook for the tutor to assess. Okay, I'm just going to click Cancel on that, but you'll click Save Changes. Right, those are the three steps that you need to go through uh, to uh, complete and then submit your journal assessment.